welcome to episode 6 of the Blind Valkyria Chronicles playthrough, or LP, or whatnot. So, uh, I haven't really done anything be between last and this episode. I did, like, one training map, I think. But, unfortunately, like, unlike this guy, there, there's not, like, quick grinding that you can really do. Um, so, let's just get into it. I'm really liking this game so far. It's, it's pretty fun. Thanks in part to Squad 7, the Great Vassal Bridge is back in our hands. That pushed the front line back, forcing the Empire to gather forces in central Gallia. Does this mean we're headed that way as well? The army will take that front. Meanwhile, the militia will head south. Our next target is here, in the Cloden area. The Cloden Wildwood. I was there last summer taking soil samples. It's a dense forest with plenty of hills and valleys. It's hard to get around in there. What's our strategic objective there, Captain? The Empire has set up a supply base there to fuel their invasion of Central Gallia. I see. So if we seize the supply base, we cut off the flow of supplies moving north. Precisely. The 3rd Regiment's objective is to take that base. All squads are to prepare for woodland combat and await orders. Good luck. Dismissed. Woodland combat? What a nightmare. What do you mean? The woods dull your sense of direction, and poor roads make for slow advances. This will be our toughest operation yet. Maybe so, but deeper in the woods you have a better chance of spotting rare foliage. There's one kind of insectivorous plant in Cloden called the Moondew that can suck a... All right, I get it. You really do have a one-track mind, you know that? I'm saying nature isn't just a burden. We might find the key to victory in the woods. All right, I'll keep a lookout for your key while I'm slogging along. Hopefully your plant won't have eaten it. Okay. So that, that's fine. I'm guessing because it's going to be woodland combat, snipers won't be that good because not like a lot of clear lines of sight. That's what I'm thinking at least. Gallia's mongrels have reclaimed Vassal Bridge. Are the men of our defensive units cowards? This loss is a stain on the Emperor's honor. Useless fools. I hear the enemy cross the river in tanks. And whoever's leading them is no fool. On the contrary, this was a fluke. These are peasants, nothing more. Peasants and barbarians. How could they be anything else? If birthright is all it takes to win a battle, you must find war so very boring. The issue here is Gallia's resistance and how to end it, swiftly and decisively. Exactly. They'll use their victory at Vassal Bridge as footing for a counter-strike in central Gallia. How shall we proceed? What says your grace? We will extinguish these flames. Our course is clear. The Gallian army must be crushed. Oh, that guy's shoulder thing is cool. We will require reinforcements. They will be sent to central Gallia. Now then, the route of supply through Cloden has to be made unshakable. Gregor, see to a restructuring of our central forces. Then you will continue to press northward. Sir. We will head to Barius. Selvaria, 
Be so kind as to accompany us there. With pleasure. And to the ends of the earth, your grace. The Cloden Basin supply lines. See to them, Jaeger. They need protecting. Galia may have already dispatched troops to the south. Therefore, make haste to Cloden. Of course. Leave it to me, your grace. Okay, so that dude's shoulder thing was really cool. It was like a... It, it was a... It sort of looked like a ram's head or something. I like that. That thing was cool. What are we doing? Remind me whose idea was it to come out here anyway? Enough with the trees already. You could say that again. Woods are so thick you can't tell up from down with these trees. Here we go. Hey, great. What did he find? A map in the dirt? Alicia, hold on to these for me, will you? Sure, Welkin. What are these? Some kind of nuts? No. Actually, they're long beard goat droppings. Ah! Gross! You made me hold poo? Are you crazy? Ugh. Hey, Welks. Did you find something useful? Come here. Take a look at this. Hmm. The grass has been trampled down, looks like. What's the deal with that? An animal trail. With any luck, this could be our way out. Animals have a natural instinct to find the most efficient path. That's why the grass is trampled down. They snap off the branches, they eat the grass. As a result, they clear a perfect trail. So if we make like goats and follow it, the path will take us through. The enemy supply base should be nearby. This is where we'll start our operation. I see a weird pig-looking creature in that. The wings. That's really nice, Rosie. What song is that? It's so pretty. Hmm? Oh, just a song I sang back in the day. Oh, you used to be a singer? I didn't know that. Ha! You paint a much prettier picture than it was. I used to sing at a bar in my town. Still, that song was really pretty. I'd love to hear the whole thing sometime. <laughs> Maybe I'll put on a little show one of these days. We're not alone here. I'll go investigate. Put your hands in the air! Moink? <laughs> Moink? Of course, because it's not a pig. It wouldn't say it. just oink. A porkavian? Okay, so it's like pork and avian. It's just a flying lamb chop. A pig? It looks like a porkavian piglet. What's your story? Get separated from your mom? Aww. I'll take a look further in. Well, what did you find? There must have been a skirmish here. It looks like a stray bullet hit his mother. Even all the way out here, the war is still claiming lives. You lost your family too, huh, little guy? Left all alone. Well, Alicia, does he want to come with us? What? Can we? We're the militia. Every Gallian has the right to join. I feel like the animals... I feel like they don't claim to be of any specific descent. You hear that? As of today, you're a member of Squad 7, little guy. And he just loves that. Can I equip that flying pig with, like, grenades that it can drop? That would be pretty dope.
Okay, so that's the battle. I'm gonna save so I don't have to tap X a lot, or tap A a lot, to get through really quickly. Um, and there's our battle. So one thing I do want to, uh, well actually yeah, I'll talk about after this. Okay. Enemy supply base is located at the east end of these woods, tucked behind a tight defensive line. Your squad will sweep in and attack from the west to capture it and cut off their lifeline. I suggest you hit the base head-on with your tank, while foot soldiers take the north path to the enemy's back. Your objective is to occupy the enemy's base camp. Tread carefully, I suspect they've planted mines all around the area leading up to the base. You should be able to see them, but be careful. Accidentally stepping on one will mean major damage. An engineer can dismantle the landmine by approaching it and pressing the A, bo uh, the A button when the command appears. Let's remember that tank can roll over landmines without sustaining damage. That's another way to clear the road. Conversely, foot soldiers can walk on larger anti-tank mines unharmed, but a tank will take tread damage. We've heard, we've heard word that enemy backup is approaching even now. Get out there and claim that base fast. Okay. So standard. Okay. So here I'm gonna want gonna want Carl the tank. Um, it's never bad to have a couple shock troopers and uh, I'm gonna take one those guys. And this is the north path, so I want Alicia. I want guys that can move quick out here. But that also I also want some heavy backup for when they come. And I'm going to keep an engineer up here to uh, take care of any mines that may be up there. But the thing I was talking about where uh, I was mistaken is that I said uh, level 11 is the max for each class. It's actually level 20. 20 is the max level. 11 is uh, the level in which the scout gets the grenade launcher. And I had mistaken that as maxing out the class. Uh, but I have read some things online where it's like, get the grenade launch, like you should try and get it as fast as possible. To which I agree with. Tank will follow the road to the south. Team two, take the trail to the base. All right, listen up and I'll explain. You don't need to explain every time about team attacks. Sometimes when units near allies attack, those allies will join in with supporting fire. Okay. Up to three units can team up and their support fire comes at no CP cost. The units in your squad each have specific other members they like especially well. Okay. Teaming up with those units will result in an exceptionally powerful attack. Staging a team attack against crushing enemies can be a smart way to defeat them. However, bunching up for team attacks can leave your soldiers open to powerful area attacks from grenades and mortars. Know when to group up for offense and when to stay spread out for defense. Okay. So, they have a base right here. Um, uh huh. I guess I'll just start moving in the tank because that would probably be one of the best courses of action. Just to start. Anti-tank gunner resided on the north bank. Pushing ahead could prove dangerous. We'll have to hope Team Two can take it out from behind. Okay. Yeah. to not attacking. Yep. Yeah. Didn't hit, but... And that action, so that means I need to come in here and take out this anti-tank cannon. So let's have Alicia run in, see what's up. Okay, there, there's a mine. Got a 
and that action. Um, not sure if this mechanic will be able to make it there, but they have more grenades than other classes. Seems fine. Because I want to... Yeah, take out the anti-tanks as fast as possible. I may just use guns on the last guy. Uh, this one I'm checking to see whether or not she can get there. And to move her up, she can't. Yeah, unfortunately not enough. Movement. But that's fine. These guys have so out of range. No, I do not want to end current action. Please hit, okay? And I just use a grenade because they get it back at the end of the turn anyway. Good work. Keep it up. Okay, and that action. They don't have as much, like, movement as other characters, so I want to move them whenever possible. So they're moving around in that base right there. Okay, so shock trooper coming in from that side. Evasion. When being attacked, units will sometimes duck under enemy fire and avoid damage. Yeah, we've seen that. It's called evasion and can be negated by attacking from the target's rear. Attacks from behind also cause the target to panic, leading to slightly lower accuracy during their counterattack. This is yet another reason to always guard your own back while actively trying to circle around your foes. Okay. Good to know. Um, okay, so they have a medium tank and a few lancers. I'm going to push up with the tank now that I can. It's going to be dumb of me not to. Those guys, they can take a goddamn... <laughs> they can take a tank shell to the chest and be fine. That is utterly amazing. Okay. Just, um, leave it to me. Okay, so that's good. They lose a move. Yippee! Good. That makes things a bit easier. Uh, There's a well, do you have a 
occupy the space so they can't call in any reinforcements on top of me. Take some people out in that area. Uh. Ain't no stopping me. Damn it. Figured I'd just shoot from there so I couldn't get counterattacked. mechanic up because the tank is probably going to start taking some damage. Put yourself in the enemy's blind spot. Watch out for gunfire from long range. I wish I could move still. I'd just take some pot shots. Well, I'm, uh, because you know, if I'm not going to heal anything, might as well just take a, a shot to try and get rid of them. No use wasting a turn. Chest. Uh, I'm going to bring Vice up. Yeah, I wasn't really expecting anything from it, and the tank is probably going to come out and try and hit my tank. Not, like, shoot a bullet at my, uh, at my other people. And that guy's gonna probably... Oh, wow, we hit. Yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna be able to heal up. Oh, and there's anti-artillery there, so I need to get someone up. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's... Okay, so the tank didn't move, but he still tried to fire at the shock trooper, which was in his line of fire, but missed because range. Okay. So... What I want to do is I want to try and attack... Oh, shit. I wanted to get the shock trooper. Take him out real quick. Okay, I'm going to have her stop 
here. Didn't I have another person? Oh yeah, she's here. But hidden. I was wondering, like, where where did my fourth person on this team go? Okay, gotta make sure I don't step on it. I probably could have healed her from that range. I'm not I'm not sure how uh right away. I'm not sure how large the um whatchamacallit is, the range of the Ragnade. Okay. So I don't know. I don't now have it, which kind of sucks. Nope, I can't use it. Yeah, I'll end that action. Okay. So now we get to here. So. Lancers can counterattack. Can't counterattack. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with him. Because that's fine. I'm gonna use Catherine. Move her out over here. To just take care of that. So we can't do any up close damage. I'll have her there. To come in. I often find that, like, I always have one person that I can't move because I, like, everyone else pushes up and they're just left back because I would have to spend too much time using them. Tank does more damage than a normal tank, as expected. Okay. as well just hostile sighted I've got a visual of a supply base up ahead just get it from close range make those guys turn. It's gonna take four shots to kill. Three 
pretty chest. At least on the turn. Pulled her back just a little bit in case they decide to try and shoot at her. Um, I do need to move her up. Can't wait. I can't have her pulled back. New target sighted. Shit. Okay, that's good. That guy. Oh, there's another guy right there. Man down. Everybody be careful. Okay, and that's an anti-tank cannon. I don't think that's going to be used on my person. And I'm not sure if I can shoot through chain link fence. Um. Okay. So what I'm going to do with her is I'm going to try and. Go out and around. Enemy supply base sighted. And catch him from the side. Well, do you have a visual on that base yet? Use the trees for cover. Probably a very stupid idea, in all honesty. Uh, okay. Now I could try and... Okay. So I'm going to try to do here... Possibly not the smartest thing I can do, but I want to Oh my god Get over the fucking thing you piece of shit God damn it. Why was that turret able to hit me? I'm calling what the hell I'm calling bullshit on that Such acid tree. So luckily Nancy didn't die. Okay. So I'm gonna have to do here. here we go. So I'm gonna have to use a decent amount of. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that. And that action. I'm gonna use the tank again to kill go. it. God damn it. Okay. 
Okay. With that, I can take care of... Him. <sighs> take care of that shock trooper. Damn it, I entered aim mode. Good. Got rid of him. Took out another turn. God, that was, that was pretty stressful, I'll be honest with you. Okay, you're gonna occupy it. And she is gonna stay right here. Okay, I wanna call in someone, but need to attack. Can I throw a grenade over the wall? I cannot. Lieutenant Nunnenkoff. So that that's a specially named guy. Ain't no stopping me. I got here hey. as soon as I could, but apparently not soon enough. General Jaeger, you brought reinforcements? A few, but this place is almost surrounded. We'll lose both the base and supplies if we hold here. Listen, I want you all to pack up what you can and get ready to evacuate. What will you do, General? Buy you boys some time. Just leave the enemy to me. God damn it. God damn it. Fucker. I just took so many more shots than I needed to. Piece of shit. Oh. I would like to go over and crouch. And that anti missile stuff. Oh god. That's why. Okay, I'm gonna end current action there. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to try and... Oh, fuck. That's why this area is right there. Um... Well... Shit. Shit. God fucking damn it. <sighs> yes. I'm dumb. I should have gone in. Tried to go around back. Oh my god. Yeah, Rosie's gonna get taken out too. Most likely. fucking turns. She's probably gonna get taken out from like a long shot or something. Oh, is it backing up? What the hell is it doing? It just went back to its original place. Go over. 
go over. I fucking... I hate how it's not a button. Are you serious? I can't get through here? Motherfucker. Does this work? Yes, it does. Good. That's not gonna work. Might as well heal her. Okay. So I'm gonna end the action here. Guessing that boss tank is going to be quite uh, tough. So, So those guys are coming to get her, which is pretty good.
check out his tracks. Carl, come up and heal. Everyone get ready. Medic! Okay, and medic. I'm not sure if the turret can. Remember to look at your surroundings. I'm not gonna risk it because Alicia can't die, so I don't have to worry about it. Which is nice. Thank you. Like any story with a character isn't like one of the normies that can die. Um, but what I will do is I will come in with uh, her. Because I need to. Because having two mechanics won't be bad. Enemy unit sighted. Be careful, soldiers. Miss Medic! Okay. Get to her. Yep. And now this is what I should have done last time. Just. Oh, I can't. Great. Really was hoping that I would be able to go back and around because there's a space there. Just um, leave it to me. phase, store that move, and hopefully have a decent amount. Because I could have called in reinforcements because I just did the medic, but... Minor damage okay. sustained. I'm glad I took out his dreads. Because his movement is now absolute shit. Damage minimal. But... So I'm doing decent damage. Um, okay, gonna end there. Gonna have Carl move up. Her up. Okay, and just you. Please hit, okay? 
Oh, good shots. would like to throw a grenade down there. Yes. Fire! Damage minimal. Okay. So it just did 20 did 700 damage. Under minor fire. Oh god. This may have been a bad idea. Seems that uh, the tank is only ever going to move twice in a turn. Here I go. Damn it. She took one more step. more turns. Like... Okay, so... I'm gonna call Alicia again for next turn. That way I have more turns. I'm gonna use... I'll do my best. Gotta use Carl to heal it, regardless. Because... Tank is like just strong enough. And I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill this guy. So I'm just gonna use Carl again. Heal. She's pointing that way in case someone comes. Okay, now what I need to do is I need to take out that shock trooper. Okay. Take out that shock trooper. going to like I don't know what to do in all honesty I should probably uh, probably I'm gonna call in oh it's, it's tough Colin. Colin Rosie for the extra turn. Because I should be able to survive another turn. I'm not worried about that. Damage minimal. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. As long as he doesn't attack again. God. These battles. They're taking longer and longer. Damn it. This guy's gonna die anyway. Here I go. Okay. That shock trooper is gonna be probably gonna be coming up towards my end. But I have several people now. Two of which give me extra turns, which is nice. So I need to heal my tank. Thank you. I'm gonna end my current action there. Uh, and then I'm going to I'll use him again. Do 
Carl is my man. He is my tank bro. Because he, he's very useful. One of his potentials is lonely, so if you just have him near the tank, he doesn't get it. And why else would you have him? Okay. So, what I need... I don't really plan on using you. Like, Rosie. I'm just hoping that guy. I think I'm going to be able to make this throw, which sucks. Um, but I will bring her up because I need to try and take the camp. Patrol has finished evacuating along with the supplies. All right. That means this base is just another patch of woods now. We'll thank the Gallians for this another day. Get the last of your men out. Welts, the enemy is abandoning the base. One step ahead. They timed that perfectly. I'm just glad that backup unit arrived late. Make good use of cover as you proceed. Can I occupy? Nope, cannot occupy. Unfortunate. Whatever. Let's go okay. with Alicia. Can't beat the smell of fresh soil. <sighs> well, that one was a bit more than I was expecting. We took their base. Yeah, we did. God. Well, you know they designed a phone good when you can't shut it the fuck up. I put it under blankets and shit, and it was still loud as hell. But they really, like, every single map, you just get, like, five times more than the last map. It's, re it's really good, nice, because it's like, okay, cool. Now I, have, now I have things to use. Okay, so I seized uh, another machine gun. 
Library tab. Okay, so that's good. Gonna save. Um, uh, let's go to the headquarters. And I'll just uh, I'll just show like how I leveled some things in the training field. So I got, I'm, I'm really just going to focus on scouts, because as of right now, like, grenades are just kind of, like, unless you catch a person off guard in a very specific way, grenades aren't as good. Like, they don't have the range. So what I'm doing is, I'm going to try and get to level 11 as fast as possible with them. And then... See where it goes from there. Uh, and then Shock Troopers will also be like my second. Lancers, apparently like, they're not all that good because they can't move. They're really only good for killing tanks. But their accuracy is shite, so you always have to get really close to them. So I'm not too, uh, I'm not too into this one. Like I'm not gonna put a lot into it until I get other ones pretty high. Uh, snipers, I will be doing a bit of, because as of right now, like, their accuracy is good, but it's not from, like, a super long range. Um, so let's just do that. Then we can go check out the, uh, armory. Uh, so R&D. R&D. Uh, develop weapons. For that, okay, machine guns. See, this wouldn't be a very large boost, except you shoot 20 times. So you get, like, essentially 20 more damage. And I saw a really cool thing where, and that was 20,000. Uh, uh, no, nah, not yet. No. Because the thing about these is, yeah, like, I use the lances and whatnot for tanks. But I out, like if I out, if I'm facing a tank, I usually run up behind the tank anyway and just shoot it from its weak point. A grenade upgrade. Ooh, that's that's good. I should take that. Okay, I upgrade the uniforms, both versions. Uh, body enhancements. I think I upgrade the anti-mortar rounds. Rolled steel. I got that. Uh, I don't really use the mortar, although I probably should a bit more. I got the first drive system, which just puts up tread defense. Uh, probably should invest in these you know, for crit defense. And expand capacity. Uh, this is just for certain things with uh, limited ammo, like the mortar. So I don't really use the mortar all that much, which is why I didn't bother investing in it. Um, so yeah, that, that's about where I'm at with those. Um, Come back again. And I haven't done anything in Castlefront, and the War Cemetery is still at 61,000 XP, which I probably should, because it makes it so I don't need to, uh, like, f because it allows me to call a medic on a downed person with just an order, instead of having to use a person to try and run out there and get it. So I might do that, like I might grind for it, but uh, um, so we're already over an hour, but I just want to finish this one chapter, and then I'll call it an episode. So I'm going to save right here, make sure I, make sure I'm all good. Well done, soldiers. The operation was a success. Another victory for Welkin Gunther! Nope, not this time. All the glory goes to this little guy. Huh? Way to go, Hans. First day on the job and you're already a hero. Our success today was thanks to the animals living in these woods. So, uh, who named the bacon Hans? Captain Varat, I'd like to introduce Squad 7's newest addition, Hans. Hans, I hear you performed admirably today. 
I expect great things from you. Dismissed. God. <laughs> oh, only in a, only in a game like this. A desert encounter. Only in a game like this where you get to, uh, this way you get a, an animal, pig, flying pig in the military. So a desert encounter. That, that's gonna be a uh, interesting one because, uh. Because I would imagine certain, you just need a lot of mobility in, uh, in these types of things. So, with that, I'm going to call this episode to an end. So, next up, uh, I'm feeling like these episodes are starting to get a bit longer, because it's really just one, uh, fight per chapter, essentially. I'm not sure how many chapters there are in the game. But, uh. I'm going to end it here, so I hope you all have a very nice day.